everybody, Joe Delia here. I'm with the owner of Cream, Sam. Thanks Hi, for Joe. joining us. Hello. Hi, you're welcome. Um, so tell us, what is what is Cream? So Cream is a specialty coffee shop here. We specialize in alternatives, meaning um, most of our milks here that we use are alternative milks. Um, we are very passionate about oat, almond, um, coconut too, and we are thinking about specializing and starting um, making our own too. We've dabbled with it <laughs> a little bit in the past and um, it's been really fun for us. So we do that. We also have all organic small handcraft batch syrups too for our coffee, which wow. really sets us apart from our competitors in big box stores. So that is something that I like I'm really passionate about healthy eating and stuff like that so yep and then we do also do uh quite a bit of retail sales here too so this is fantastic what did you get me <laughs> um so i made you a caramel lavender latte with oat milk yeah that's great i like it good what is uh so what is your your so you've got coffee you also have lunch in the back yep, so what, we do. when people come in here what's the kind of the experience you want them to have um, I want them to um, value our products that they're receiving. Um, all of our quality standards, I say, are extremely high. Um, we actually did shut down for a little bit when COVID first started here um, because we could not get our products. And for me, I'm not going to open and sell an inferior product. I would just rather be closed, as silly as that sounds. Yeah, sure. um, or health. smart. Yeah. Could be smart. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, health is very important to me. Um, I live a very healthy lifestyle, so I want my business to represent me. Got it. What? Um, so obviously, as a business owner, you have choices as to where you can go and open up shops. So yeah. why Lapeer? Um, I think Lapeer for me is super important because I like the small, close knit community feel. We have that here. Like, I mean, as you've seen, like multiple people have walked in and sure. I'm like, hey, hey, right. um, which is cool. I love that. And it's just nice. I feel like your customers appreciate you more when you know them. You know, I have so many customers that come in when they walk in. I know exactly what they want. They get the same thing every time. Um, and I think that's a cool experience. So when I walked in here, I thought, what a cool concept, mm -hmm. right? So up front, you've got, you know, kind of, you said it, it's really, um, I don't know how you would articulate it, but really a custom offering in terms yes, of, yep. of, of beverage, right? But then in addition to that, you have a lot of also custom product yeah, that it looks do. like on, yep. on the shelves. So when, so when someone comes in here, what is the typical experience that they have? Um, I think it's pretty cool. Like, it's kind of fun, too, because, you know, some people walking by might not realize that we're a coffee shop. They'll see the retail that we have in the windows, and then they'll walk in to shop, but then they'll also get coffee. So it's kind of cool to, like, cross-promote yourself like yeah. that. And I feel like I felt the need for more retail down here. And I think that is something that we need and just having unique products and stuff. And I felt the gap in the market down here for that and I wanted to fill it, so. So how's it worked out? It's been going amazing. Um, we actually like tripled our retail sales. Like we did have a couple things, but just definitely not the volume that we have now. And it's been like one of the best decisions I've made. What would you say led you to tripling your, your sales? Um, so I do a lot of social media marketing myself on like my personal Instagram and I um, I've actually worked with like a lot of very big retail stores. Um, I'm actually a sustainability ambassador for IKEA. Um, I work I'm a anthro ambassador for anthropology. Um, I do a lot of stuff for like the citizenry. So a ton of like home decor, interior design stuff is like my passion. Okay. So I have like realized how into like sustainable goods and stuff I am and how important it is when, you know, things are being made and that everybody's like treated fairly in that. So I wanted to showcase that with a lot of the products we have in here. So I have a lot of things from like small stores to like, you know, we have stuff from Magic Linen. They're all like sustainably stores in like Lithuania, which I love that. And they pay their workers fairly, which is important to me, so. It sounds like you have a very purpose-based purpose, uh, purpose -based driven business. Was yes, that fair to say? Yes, we do, yep, yeah. yep, yeah. So everything that we get is very intentional, like intentional living. 
Um, even like our cups, everything is biodegradable. Seas are biodegradable, straws are biodegradable. Like I want everything in here to be good for the earth and for you, so. I love that. I, I think it is, uh, when I walked in here, I thought what a cool concept, mm -hmm. right? Like yeah. when you, you've got a lot of different things going on and you said it, they might walk in, the consumer walk in thinking your retail store and then, oh, but they happen to also sell coffee. Yeah. Right? Yep. Or, and amongst teas and amongst yes. other things, yep. right? Yep. Or they know you're known for this and then yeah. they're like, oh, wow, they sell products, yeah, and right? Even, and that's kind of the way that we started out was with the coffee and like all of our customers that come in now, they're like, this is so cool. Like yeah. you guys added so much fun thing. I want everything in here. So awesome. it's super cool. Well, thank you for your yeah. time. I want oh, all you sorry. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you for your time. I want everyone to come check out Kareem. It's a really, really cool shop in downtown Lapeer. And uh, 24 is not Lapeer. Hang a right or a left, depending on yeah, which direction yep. you're coming from. And come down on the street and come check it out. It's really, really cool. I never even knew all this existed, which is one of my favorite things about coming and doing these. So uh, I hope you guys come experience. Leave her a five-star yeah. review on, <laughs> on Google and the rest of it. And uh, thank you so much. Hey, thanks for uh, watching the video. Subscribe below, like the video, leave a comment. Tell us what you liked. Tell us maybe what you didn't like. Tell me where you want us to go next, and we'll see you next time.